is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight, Episode 9, Dark Side Jedi Knight, I should clarify. So! Welcome back, Master. If you detect the aroma of Alderanian nectar, I program the air circulators to simulate it. Enjoy! I'm allergic to that. Anyway, last time we were told that Admiral Hacklin one of Darth Angrel's followers, wants to defect to the Republic, so we must go and meet him, or her, him, her, him, her, shake it all about. Uh, he, yes, him, yes. I mean, the Hackling could be a female, for all I know. I mean, it's been a long time since I played this story, so I don't know. Um, and we're going to make our way to the abandoned, I don't know why I'm going down there, the abandoned mining facility, and hope that it's not a trap. It could be a trap, who knows? Kira needs to speak to me, but hey, I don't know if I'll do the companion stories in this series, because I've already done the companion stories on my main character, and I just, I don't know if I want to do them all over again. It just feels a bit pointless. Ooh, that's a nice little spinny thing. Yeah, it's just like a little Ah, nice little icon. It's even... Ah, it's just something about it. It just it piqued my interest. Anyway, I'm being steady. Uh, this asteroid field once hosted a thriving one processing industry, but Zerka Corporation withdrew when profits dwindled. The company abandoned a small mining facility here. And now we are traveling to it. And now we must explore it. Oh, I've got some mail. Oh, I've got three bits of mail. What are these three bits of mail? Three? Blimey, did I do that much stuff that I got three people sending me messages? Uh, well, I've got a commendation. Lovely. I have gratitude from Dr. Godera and some spam. Of course, I will, uh, you know, you can't see the MMO um, URL, which they're telling me. Apparently, two million credits equals four dollars. Wow. Wow. Hacklin! I'm here. Uh, I must have Kira Carson. She's right here. W what are you going on about game? She's right here. Uh, do I need some med packs? I actually, uh, no, I don't. Have I got my stim packs? Do I have any stim packs? No, I don't have any stim packs. Stand wow. For examination and suggested products. I shall do, actually. Could I? Ooh. Oh, mastery. There we go. That's what I need. Wait. Do I have any mastery stim packs? I guess not. Duty, Wait, do I still have my willpower and all that stim packs on other characters that I have? I don't know. I guess I'll have to find that out if I still have my willpower, strength, and all that. Uh, right. Hello? It's very eerie here. It's kind of spooky. Um. Hello? Anyone here? Oh, hello. You, Valis. Greetings. I am Valis. Your quick response is most appreciated. Please forgive the deception. Admiral Hacklin remains Darth Angrel's faithful servant. His name simply made this meeting convenient. He's a Sith. Kill him! <laughs> now, really, is that any way to treat your family? Mm, explain yourselves. Family? Kira, you know this man? Don't listen to him. He's trying to confuse you. Us. Your Padawan isn't who you think. She's no Jedi. She's a child of the Emperor, like me. And it's time she returned to our father's warm embrace. I knew you were trouble, Kira. I've never been much of a Jedi. Figures you're a Sith. I'm not a Sith. Don't let him turn you against me. We can defeat him, together. We have no quarrel, Jedi. Return to your ship and let Kira come home. The Emperor wills it. And of course, the Emperor wills it, but I don't have the option to actually walk away. Maybe I mean I was just saying maybe I will just walk away, but no doubt I actually won't walk away. You betrayed me. Why shouldn't I let him have you? I'm your Padawan. I've always been loyal to you. Was loyalty what kept you from revealing your true origins? Even after Darth Angrel recognized you on Ord Mantel? Accept the truth, sister. You belong to the Emperor. And our father will have you back. No, I'll die first. So die. So be it, sister. And now we must defeat Valis. And my dog is actually barking in the background. You can't hear her bark, but I can. Well, you might be able to hear her bark, I don't know. Might appear in the recording. We'll find out soon. There she is barking again. Hooray! Uh, do I have my heroic moment? I do. 
Heroic moment, yeah. And flamethrower. And legacy portrait. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. What, what, what on earth has happened there? Uh, and die. Well, that was easy. All right, let's return to the ship. Oh, what? Whoa. whoa. Let's get the hell out of me. I'm thinking, who the hell is coming towards me? No, it's just, of course, there's other people who could actually be in this area. How many phases are there? Is there just, is there just one phase? Yeah, only five people in this area. Wow, so many people are doing the Jedi Knight story right now. Intercom, 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 intercom. You're going to abandon me. No questions, no chance to explain. Can you blame me? I just found out you and the Emperor are relatives. What did you expect? You don't know the whole story. My parents were Sith, but the Emperor isn't my father. Child of the Emperor is just a title. I was taken from my parents when I was a baby. Raised in the Sith Academy with others like Vallis. It was... Brutal. You've been taught the ways of the dark side. Mm, sort of. Never been much of a student, and some things I'd rather forget. Every so often, the other children were taken to see our father. They came back different. Nobody ever remembered meeting the Emperor. One day, I realized I couldn't remember anything from the past week. They were doing the same thing to me. All I'm hearing is you're a liar, and you're crazy. I'm not crazy. Sometimes I can almost remember what happened, but it's like something out of a nightmare. I was still a child then. Small enough to stow away on a supply ship leaving Imperial space. Lived in lots of bad places until I met Master Coix. She brought me to the Jedi. Changed my life. Surprised she didn't sense anything around you. You've been keeping secrets, Kira. That's not what Jedi do. I always knew sooner or later I'd have to come clean. Just hoped I could prove myself as a Jedi first. Now the Emperor knows where I am. The Sith will never stop hunting me. You're more trouble than you're worth. First chance I get, I'm dumping you off on Tython. Fine. Turn me into the Council. I bet they'll be more open-minded. Let's go. The General's waiting to hear from you. Ah, uh, I hate hating on Kira, but of course, this is the whole point of Dark Side. Because she is an asshole. It's the whole point. And now I bet if I were to do her companion story, she'd be like, Hey, yeah, we're best buds. Yay. Uh, where's my holo terminal? It's over. What? What was that? What? What the hell is that? Hello? Um. Is there anyone here? I don't know. Um, that was kind of weird. No idea what that was, but I guess we'll move on. Um, hello, um, Vasuthra. The Admiral was never here, General. This was a trap. Last. I'm sorry for putting you in harm's way on a lie. It won't happen again. I'm afraid there's more bad news. Your Jedi Masters both missed their last two comm checks. Typical. That isn't like Master Kawix. What planet did you send her to? Tatooine. Master Orgus went to Alderaan. I need you to find out what's happened to them and our weapon labs. Understood, General. But first, I need to consult with the Jedi Council on an important matter. More important than saving the galaxy from Darth Angrel? I'd like to know what that is. Mind your own business. I don't owe you any explanations. Whatever your problem is, solve it fast. Our enemy could strike at any time. May the Force be with us all. Barsuthra out. Let's get this over with. Master Kowicz and Orgus need our help. I'll be meditating in my quarters. Let me know when we're at Tython. I love how Kira actually approved of me just being all like, Mind your own goddamn business. Uh, now, has What's-His-Face sent me any more holo recordings? I don't know. Uh, I forgot his name now, it's been so long. I hope it was with the lightsaber. Yep, seen this before. Whatever. Right, let's move on. Again? What, what, what is that? It's occurring every time I go past this spot. There it is again. Where the, where the hell is that coming from? This is so weird. I'm a bit concerned. Um, is anyone else having this problem? 
I have no idea. Lit is someone is someone attacking a dummy? A training dummy? I, I have no idea. Where would the training dummies be on my ship? Uh, are they here? No. I don't know where they would be, but this is just so weird. Ooh, T7. Um, this is just so weird and a bit concerning that this is actually happening in my ship. Um, but hey, I guess we'll just move on. Yay, I reached Tython before I finished coming out of Hydra Space. Woohoo! I always love that. Me doing that. Hey, it reminds me of that scene from... Oh, wait, I can't talk about The Force Awakens because there are people who are watching this video who still haven't seen The Force Awakens. What is wrong with you? Go and watch The Force Awakens now! Also, I've had a few people telling me to make Kishula's lightsaber a reddish sort of colour because, of course, her lightsaber right now is uh, a very light blue. Patience, people. Patience. She's slow. She's she's not fully dark side yet. She's still on alignment one. She'll she'll become dark side soon enough. Just be patient. Patient, okay? She'll get her lightsaber one day. Just not today. Masters, I bring troubling news. Master Satil, my mission has become more complicated. Masters Orgas and Quix have disappeared. I'm headed for Tatooine and Alderaan to find them. But first, my Padawan has something important to tell you. Kira? I was born on Dromund Cause. My parents were Sith. Ooh, much easier the second time. There's more, obviously. <laughs> I should hope so. Give me time to assemble the Council. Most of us are still off-world. And then my master convinced me to come here and tell you. That's pretty much everything. We've heard rumors about these children of the Emperor before, but this finally confirms their existence. Troubling that we never sense the truth about Kira, and Master Kuix brought her to us. That makes her especially dangerous. She can't be allowed to remain free. I agree! This master should have a voice in this. What do you recommend? Well, it doesn't matter what I'm gonna say, you're gonna not, you're gonna just not care. I say Arrest imprison her. And interrogate her. Find out what she's still hiding. Exactly. Contain the threat until we understand it. Jedi are not jailers, Master Kaden. It's obvious she's told us everything she knows. I reached out through the Force while Kira spoke. I detected sadness and confusion, not malice. Yes. Despite her origins, I feel no trace of the dark side within her. It was natural for you to fear our reaction, considering your upbringing. What's important now is that you leave your past behind. And devote yourself to the Jedi. Can you do that? See, I've doesn't matter what I say. Ever since Master Quix found me. Should Kira stay, or should she go? What do you think, Masters? Should Kira remain my Padawan? Clearly not. I see no reason to punish a student who admits her error. Agreed. And I believe the best course of action is to leave Kira where she is. Are you sure? This is a mistake. If Master Quix were here, she'd tell you the same. Until she returns, this council's ruling stands. Kira is safest in your care. If you say so. I hope you're right about this, Master Satil. Release your worries. Kira has earned our trust. I promise I'll make you all proud. Even you, Master Caden. <laughs> you did well bringing this to us, but you should return to your mission. May the Force be with you on Tatooine and Alderaan. I did well bringing this to you? What? Does that even make any sense? You did well bringing this to me. It's like... If I didn't, would you... It just kind of makes no sense. I can't explain it. It just makes no sense. You did well bringing this information to me. So, if I brought some, you know, troubling news but not that troubling, you'd be well... Oh, well that's kind of... Oh, bad, bad boy. Bad boy, Charlie. You know, you just... You, you didn't... You didn't bring me terrible news. You bring me you brought me bad news, but not terrible news, Charlie. God! Kira probably really, really hates me right now. But the good news is it's nothing some companion gifts couldn't fix. If I was even going to bother gaining influence with my characters. But I probably should because it makes them more effective. But I'm not going to anyway because I'm able to solo this crap. Let's use my intercom. You were pretty harsh. If the Council had listened to your recommendation, I'd be locked up. 
You're never leaving my ship. Uh, <laughs> nah, it wasn't personal. I was only doing my job, Padawan. Your job, right. Just so you know, I won't hold a grudge about this. Wouldn't be very Jedi-like. Let's go. get back to work, Master. Feel the hate flow through you. Level 27. Woo! Wait, I gained influence with Kyo- What? I gained influence? What? What is happening? What is happening? Anyway, we're making our way to Tatooine now. Again, that noise is there. What the hell is that noise? I really don't know. Can somebody tell me? Does anybody know what that noise is? I'm not going to Alderaan, although I could, probably. Uh, we're going to go to... Tatooine. Oh, what's this new ability I've just got here? Zealous Leap. When did I get this? Just now. General, I'm on Tatooine. Has Master Quix reported in? As we heard, Kuwix secured our weapons research facility. She's missed every comm check since then. Enemy action is the most likely scenario, but on Tatooine, anything's possible. I hope it's as lawless as Nar Shaddaa. Outside the main settlements, the only laws are those of the wild. People vanish there all the time. Some are lost to the native sand people, others to natural predators. The rest, who knows? The sand. Dr. Glodera will brief you on the weapons project. Doctor? The hey, Gadara. The facility on Tatooine has created a device codenamed the Shock Drum. The weapon discharges massive ultrasonic vibrations into the ground. It damages enemy fortifications at a microscopic level, quite literally softening them up. Sustained ultrasonic damage is highly destructive to droid parts. The vibrations will cripple people if they're close enough. But that's not all. The shock drum eventually disrupts the planetary core. At critical mass, the core explodes. Were you planning to destroy Tatooine? Of course not. When we discovered this potential, we immediately stopped testing. However, there's a fully operational shock drum prototype at our facility. If Darth Angrel has captured it, the results will be catastrophic. With no word from the facility or Master Kuix, we must assume the worst. I sense Master Kawik through the Force, but it's faint. I think she's dying. Calm yourself, Padawan. Calm yourself. Control your emotions, Kira. Don't give in to fear. I'm not afraid, but she can't die. I owe her too much. I don't have any Republic contacts there to assist you. You're on your own. Classic. Our facility is located in a remote part of the desert. I'm transmitting the coordinates. Good luck. Barsuthra, out. But I'm not on my own. I have Kira with me. Or should I bring T7 with me? Hmm. If I bring T7, he might, you know, become droid parts. You know, I still don't understand why they haven't done this with every single planet. Surely it really doesn't take much to do this animation with every single planet. Surely. Just, you know, get a camera movement, have it sway to the left a little bit, have your ship just dive down and just put a few lights in there and you're done. Surely. I mean, yeah, sure, maybe get another texture for the planets, each planet, because the current textures of the planets are horrible, but, you know, seriously, what, it would take about an hour's work per planet? Yeah? Just for, what, ten seconds of gorgeousness? Could you imagine what this game would be like if perhaps I actually was able to lock up Kira? Could you imagine that? That would just be absolutely immense. This game would be amazing. If you could actually do those choices, like with um, that other thing which happened on my Sith Warrior, which I can't mention because there are people who are watching this series and it's the first class that they're watching and, you know, they don't want to be spoiled of other classes. But that thing that happened uh, like a two-thirds of the way through the Sith Warrior story that happened. Yeah, that thing. Imagine if I was able to actually kill that person of that thing. It would be cool. It would be really, really cool. But of course, Bioware didn't go that far with this game, which is an absolute bugger. Um, and even with Kotor, uh, Ko Kotor Kopfi, it kind of feels like that they've not really gone that far just yet. Just yet. We're still waiting to see for the next few chapters that'll come out. But it just doesn't seem like that they're going that far with things. So you know, you are very pink. Hello, who are you? 
Um, you've even made your companion pink. Oh, it's Theron. What have you done with Theron? Why have, why have you put him in troop armor? How dare you do that to Theron? He's a doctor, not a goddamn... What was that quote which he said from the Star Trek 2009 movie? I can't remember the quote. Hmm. He's a doc... I'm a doctor, not a goddamn something. Uh, somebody tell me in the comments. You better tell me in the comments. Oh no, the sand people have found me. Well, guess what? They're going to die instantaneously. Dead. Ooh, cold-blooded. Uh, defeated 10 reels and... I haven't done that yet? Okay, well, thank you very much. Oh my god, people. I have an excuse to say it. He's frozen in time. You're hogging the limelight, Kira. Better. Um, 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 how am I going to get past these enemies without being seen? Um, 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 if I go around like this, perhaps? I mean, I know, sure, I could just kill them and it'll be over in about 10 seconds, but... I can't be bothered to kill them. I'd rather just try and find another way around. Uh-oh. I think I've had this problem before. I'm stuck in the terrain. No! No! Crap. I'm stuck. Oh, no, no. Wait. I got out! Woo! Watch there be an enemy around this corner now. Nope. We're good. Thank you very much. Right. I'm in the shock drum facility. What am I looking for? Whatever it is, it's upstairs. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have to kill some sand people. Sorry, sand people, but you're gonna have to die. Oh, have I got Kira down as a healer? Oh, okay. Well, thanks, Kira. Yeah, you can be a healer. Because pff, I'm the DPS. I'm the hero, not you. You just hero the hero. And uh, now it's time to be a hero. Ooh, if I use this ability, what does it do? Ooh, that was quite a nice ability. Oh, hello. Some more sand people. Well, they're all dead anyway. Oh, for God, stop knocking me back! Um, 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 open the sealed door. I wonder if I can just sort of sneakily open the door without being seen. No? Oh, okay. Worth a shot. You know, at this rate, I might as well do the bonus mission because I'm like halfway there anyway. So, uh, excuse me while I do the bonus mission a moment. Lightsaber jerk. That is very impractical, by the way. Could you imagine somebody actually trying to eat a lightsaber? Somehow I just had a picture in my head of somebody having a lightsaber on a plate and if they've got their knife and fork and they're just about to tuck into a lightsaber. Just being all like, mmm, crystally. Oh, thank you for dropping down, because that has made it a perfect 16 for me. So thank you, you've just completed my bonus mission for me. Wait. Wait, wait, hold on. I ki I I killed there was I needed twelve I needed four more. One more dropped down, making the four more I needed. And yet somehow that's only counted for three. What? And bonus mission complete. Thank you very much. I'll take the experience however much it No Oh <sighs> Don't you love it when you accidentally attack the people you're not meant to attack? Open the sealed door. Well that's not opening, that's just Breaking and entering. A Jedi? Seabrick, I told you help would come. Brick happy being wrong. We'd almost given up hope. Thank you for saving our little family. You're not actually related. Not all families are bound by genetics. Ours was formed by circumstance. Heron saving Brick's clan after we losing home to sand people. Brick wearing, swearing to repay kindness Have you come to on the shop, the shop yeah. drum, like Master Kawix? It's hard what to translate to a Jawa. She defended us against Imperial soldiers led by a Sith. She fought bravely, but the Sith was stronger. When I find him, he'll learn I don't die as easily. She isn't dead. At least not the last time I saw her. I assumed he was going to kill us all. Instead. He captured Master Kawix alive and ignored us. Not ignoring, scary man destroying Brick's droids. The Sith destroyed your droids, but he didn't harm us. He said we were no threat, that we didn't deserve to die. The Sith are masters of betrayal. You're obviously working for him. Tell me the truth. I could never lie to a Jedi or, or anyone. Please, you have to believe me. The Sith and his soldiers took Master Kawix and the shock drum prototype into the desert. Brick and I were attempting to restore power to this facility and track them down when the Sand People attacked. Sand People always wanted a facility, waiting for sign of weakness, seeing chance after Scary Man leaving. 
Why would sand people want a research base? Sand people hating everyone, not like them. Attacking farms, mining this operations. This can pick up the shock drums locator beacon, but not until we restore power. The Sith knocked out all our generators during his attack. If you reactivate them, we can find him, Master Kawix, and the shock drum. Power generators being in desert. Desert being full of more sand people. You have good luck out there. Wow. So I have to save the day while you Jowers cower in fear. <sighs> so anyway, I'm going to go dance with the Jowers now. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you next time. I'm dancing with the Jowers. I'm dancing with the Jowers. I'm dancing with the Jowers. And a farewell to you. I'm dancing with the Jowers. I'm dancing with the Jowers. I'm dancing with the Jowers.